It was a council meeting presided over by the president with most of the ministers in attendance. The Federal Executive Council believes that the draft bills will go a long way to benefit all Nigerians. Taking together, you know, uh, these uh, uh, various initiatives constitute a major breakthrough, part of the uh, effort by the uh, administration uh, to continue to strengthen various sectors of the uh, of the uh, economy and of our society and to continue to provide opportunities for Nigerians uh, to raise the quality of life and to deepen uh, already existing efforts that have been done by government and also to continue to move the country forward. He makes way for the Minister of Transport and his colleague in the Works Ministry to shed more light on what the transport reform bills are out to do. The reform of the federal government in transportation is aimed at institution, instituting a private sector driven economy to align with the overall objective of the federal government economy policy and the vision 2020. The road settle had two of its reform bills approved by the Federal Executive Council. And these are the National Road Fund Bill and of course the Federal Road Authority Bill. The National Road Fund Bill essentially is to, is to guarantee the sustainable maintenance of road development, construction, rehabilitation, and maintenance across the country. The Minister of Industries, Trade and Investment explains what the Federal Competition and Consumer Protection Bill will do. This bill actually expands the role from just consumer protection to, con to competition bill. So uh, it addresses areas such as monopoly, which everyone has complained about, uh, the issue of price fixing, uh, the issue of mergers, uh, the issue of consumer rights, and the penalties that should come from that. While the Minister of Environment says the Great Green Wall Draft Bill will help government to carry out the project guided by some laws, the Minister of Agriculture says the step of crop processing zones policy will enable Nigerians to guard against losses incurred in food processing. That will help the Ministry to be able to carry out our functions within the ambit of the law. Uh, we know the problem of uh, the Sahara Desert and the effect of climate change in our country. And if care is not taken, the devastation effect will be enormous and great in our country. As a government, uh, we took a decision that even though we are succeeding in terms of reducing our food, food import bill, which of course you know has gone down significantly, and also since we are producing a lot more food, that we must add value to every single thing that we have. And so this staple crop processing zone will be our new instrument to allow us to bring private sector food manufacturing companies into the rural economy. The Federal Executive Council is hoping that the draft bills will receive prompt attention by the National Assembly so that Nigerians will begin to benefit from the federal government initiatives. Chukuma Onwekusi, Channels Television News.